What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Yami. And today, as you can see, we have 2K25. Shouts out to my boy, Chris, for getting the game and letting me game share it off him. Love you, my heart. Shouts out to you. Now, this is going to be my first build video ever, so don't cook me. But, um, you know what I'm saying? Let's just get straight into it. All right, name, last name, TDG Yami, as you know. Hand this and jersey number, whatever you want. Me personally, um, I prefer my left hand. I am ambidextrous though. And I love 22 as my jersey number. Now, y'all know me, love small forwards. And every year, first build is a 6'6 six, six small forward. This year, however, is different as in my weight. I put my weight at 195 pounds. So I could get gold lightning launch, which uh, lightning launch is very important to the way I want to play as I am a dribbler. Y'all know this. And you know what I'm saying? Very important in general for speed in this game since everybody is so slow. Seven foot wingspan for the steals, defense. You know what I'm saying? You want to be get good contests. Now, let's start off with close shot. We're going to go to a 69 close shot. You know what I'm saying? For that bronze paint, paint potter. Paint, paint prodigy. My fault. Driving layup. We're going to go straight to an 80. We get that layup mix master. Lay, uh, 80 is all you need. Um, And driving dunk. We're going to go to 80. I'm going to tell y'all why um, when I upgrade my vert. Now we're going to go to shooting. Shooting, we're gonna upgrade the midi to an 80, and we're gonna max out our three. Everyone's going threes that are in the 90s. Me personally, I only need an 86 to green, as you will see later on in the video, and uh, I feel comfortable with 86. Free throw, we're gonna go 72. So, you know, we're saying we can shoot free throws just in case the bros want to go into wreck. Pass accuracy. We're going to go straight to an 85 as we want bailout and gold dimer and versatile visionary. You know, very important. We're going to max out our ball handle and max out our speed with ball. Get that gold lightning launch. Get gold ankle assassin. I've seen the ankle breaker clips. It's crazy this year. Gold handles for days. We're one away from Hall of Fame and I'm mad that they won't let me get it as a small forward. Trust me, I tried. The only way I could get it is if I go 6'5". And that's not me, bro. I'm sorry. Um, this badge will come into play later. And I'm going to pluckable. As we don't want to get plucked. Because uh, everybody's going to have an 80 plus steal rating this year. For some reason. Interior defense. We went with the 60. For bronze paint controller. Which you will see later on. Perimeter defense. We're going with an 82 so we can get that silver challenger as I am not the main defender out of my friend group MPS. Um, you know what I'm saying? I still have good skilled defense and I know my lanes, which is what we're going to talk about next. Steel, everyone's going 85 plus for more interceptor and more glove. Me, I went with a 73 for that um, silver interceptor. And bronze glove, as in my opinion, I don't really need that much. I'm not going to be spamming square anyway. I just want to be in the lanes. And if you've watched Thizo and everybody else's videos, you know, you would know that past lanes are really uh, OP this year. So at least get minimum silver interceptor. Minimum. If you really want to be like that, go ahead and go for the gold. But uh, that's not me. Block, we're going to go straight to a 74 as we get the high flying denier. We get the paint patroller, bronze. Defense rebound, we're going to go to a 50. So we got at least attempt to jump for the boards. You know what I'm saying? Don't want to be bunyans, bunyans. In earlier years, I would upgrade that more, but I realized more and more that that's not my main focus. Speed. 85. 
You know what I'm saying? Got to be fast up and down the court. And also this affects your 94 feet. So your movements on defense and how fast or slow you are. Agility. Um, heard around 80 is all you need. Watch some videos on it. So, you know what I'm saying? One with 80. Strength. We're going to go 65 along with that speed with ball and ball handle to get you silver physical handles and bronze physical finisher. You know what I'm saying? Give me, give me a little bit of bump animations as a 6'6". Six, six. And then for vert, we're going to go 70 vert. Now, the reason we want 70 vert and an 80 dunk, and that's all you really need, is because of the, I believe Steezo said it was the Malik Monk dunk package. He said it's all you really need, and I believe him as when I was watching his video, uh, that's all he was really using. And if you make it right, you get shades of Cal Bridges, John, Joe Johnson, and Brandon Miller. And your build should be called a wing creator, man. Now we're going to get into the test build. Um, and I'm going now, before I get into this, I want y'all to know, do not take this as um, Take it at face value, man. This is the SIGs that I found were the best for me thus far. Obviously, Steezo, other YouTubers, and myself will find better SIGs throughout the year. So, that being said, this is just what I found my first day of playing 2K25 when I made my build and I was in the uh, shooting area. I I wasn't gonna show y'all my jump shot in this video, and you know what? I'm still not. I don't care. Um, suffer. <laughs> but I will tell y'all though. Um, I made three jump shots, and I know at least two of them are chicken. So uh, y'all might want to listen to my advice when I talk about my jump shots. Kobe Bean, you know what I'm saying? For that free throw, that's the free throw I've used every year since 2K20. Layup style, LaMelo ball, good enough for me. Dunk style, Malik Monk isn't in, in here. So uh, I just went with Clay. Clay is also really good. Go to shot. Now, this is important. Go to shot. There are two that I found that are really great for small forwards. Rui Hachimura, look at that. Uh, let's. Mm, that's really good. Kevin Herter's mid. But then you got where's it at? Uh Jalen Suggs, man. Look at Jalen Suggs. Uh, uh, uh. Nice. But uh my opinion, if you're a small forward and you're around my height, that Rui Hachimura is what you want to go for. Dribble pull up. I went with all George. Um, you know what I'm saying? Really easy to time, in my opinion. Nothing too hard. Spin jumper, pro. Y'all know this. Cheese every time. Baseline run, fake them out. Huh. Spin jumper, cook them. Pop jumper. I also went with Paul George. Where's he at? Paul PG. You know what I'm saying? Post fade, Harrison Barnes. Post hook. When we Giannis, because Joel and Beats no longer there. He's probably going to come out in a later season. Post hop shot, Harrison Barnes. Motion style doesn't matter. Probably going to choose my goat, LeBron. Pass style, um, this year I don't know it's the best. None, fundamental, LaMelo, Tyrese, Kyrie, LeBron, and Magic all look good to me. I chose Magic, though. I, I like the way his passes look. Dribble style, I chose pro. I went through all of them, and, you know, I I think that I was really the fastest. For me, my opinion, um, as you can see, and uh, Kyrie's probably going to be the best dribble style all around, but I'm not making a short guard because that's just not me, man. Signature size up, man. I chose pro. Um, I like the way it looks. Just some simple... Some little, little aggressive, simple, nothing too 
major um, later in the year that will most definitely change. I'm gonna say without a doubt it will change. Regular breakdown combo. I chose Kawhi. Um, like I said, something simple. You know what I'm saying? Regular breakdown combo is not to be too much. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted the tweens because I'll we'll probably like explode out of it with a cross. You know what I mean? Something simple. Aggressives. I chose Paul George. As in, you know what I'm saying? Paul George, he walks up. And what you can do is you can use Paul George, get that start animation where you walk up and then do a Luka step back, which is what everyone's using right now from the animation I've seen and just green that hell, man. It's that simple. Skate moves, I chose Kobe. Um, really great, hold on, let me, let me let the animation play out, look. Really great, aggressive. I like the way it looks. Uh, pro combos, um, I don't think this one really matters too much. I just went with James Harden. I think that's the one I chose in 24. Y'all didn't get to really see me play that one, but it's because of, it's because of this move right here, right there. You can crab someone off that um, crossover. I went Zachy. Um, Zachy was good last year when I first started out. Um, I also wanted to do Kobe, but they kind of changed the animation to that little like stutter step. I don't really like it. So, I just went with, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Tyrese's one isn't bad, but the Hezzy takes a little too long. So, yeah, like I said, man, Zach Levine. Behind the back, I went with Paul George as Tom, what's his name? Jamal Murray's isn't in the game yet, but hold on. This animation right here, right there. That is the reason why I chose it. Spin. I miss basic spin low key. Um, I'm gonna have to test it out and see if it's good this year, but um, I know Tyrese's um, from 24, I'm pretty sure was really good. And then obviously the best one, Steve Nash, has the best uh, half spin, and half spins are really important. It's gonna catch your defender off guard. Hesitations, now this one is weird. Luca, if you look at this animation, Luca has a really tight hesitation. I don't know if I'm cooking, but I think Lucas is going to be really, really good this year. Um, I'm going to wait for some other people to look at it. You know what I'm saying? Jason Tatum's is really good for bigger players. Um, as always, you know what I'm saying? Paul George's is cool. He just does a little bit too much. Tyrese's didn't look bad. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? I chose uh, Paul George, man. I mean, it's all right. Actually, nah, bro. Bro, go with Jason Tatum, bro. Lock in. Best one from last year for my uh, build. So why not? And then step back. Obviously, you want Luka. That right there. That right there. That move right there is going to be step back. Not space. Your main way to get space and get open. And that move right there is uh, the Krabby Specialist move. If you played any 2K before 24, you know that that move right there is the Krabby move. I mean, let's play my career or not. Because uh, if you're a Lamelo ball fan and play Lamelo, Lamelo also has that move. And uh, in Blacktop, you could get a bunch of crabs with it. So, uh, Putting y'all on blacktop game as well. <laughs> Triple threat, I use Michael Jordan. And flashy passes, I use Wizard. Um, jump shot, y'all will be getting this in another video. Now, I'll be back when we are in the game. All right, y'all. So as you can see, we are in the practice. Now, um, I'm gonna show y'all why I chose each dribble. So basically, Pro dribble style, you know what I'm saying? Some look fast. Um, yeah. look, look quick. Now we're going to go into signature size up, man. So basically, 
You know what I'm saying? If you want to see it, probably just some um, slight for now. It's probably going to change in the future, but look at it. It's not bad, though. Uh, 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 it's cool. All you have to do is flick your stick. Regular breakdown combo. You know what I'm saying? Look, Hawaii. You go, uh, uh. You go, uh, uh, uh. You know what I'm saying? Something slight. Aggressive. Now with the aggressive one, he goes like that. So you'd want to, uh, 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 uh. Green. See what I'm saying? Like, this Paul Georgia, he's going to walk forward, step back, green. Every time. As y'all can see, my chumper, chumper, my jumper is chicken. So with that being said, um, if y'all want my jumper video, stay tuned. That will be coming soon. And uh, I have three jump shots. Um, I know at least two of them are chicken. There's one I'm not too sure about, but uh, we going to test all of them. And yeah, y'all listen. Now, next dribble move would be the escape moves, as y'all can see. Look at that, hold on. Escape move. Escape move. But, uh. Like a, uh. You see what I'm saying? But, the speed boost, uh. Time that move. Um, combo move. I actually really don't even know how to do that with it, so. But, uh, if you watched Joe Knows last year, you would see how uh, good the James Harden one is. My fault. Crossover, as you can see, crossing over in that paint. It could get you that little, that little angle change you need last second if your defender catches up to you too quick. If you want it, you could half spin. After it, you know what I'm saying, do a double fake. Behind the back, now, y'all probably been seeing me do it. It's that one. You know what I'm saying? You could. Uh, 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 uh. You know what I'm saying? You could. You could. Uh, uh, uh. Pull up, you know what I mean? And the way I like to use it is Luca step back and then just, you know what I'm saying? So you would be like, uh. Luca step back, uh, uh, green. You know what I mean? Quick look, quick look. Quick stop, uh, Luca step back, uh, uh, pop it. You know what I mean? Which is why you have to have a quick jumper. Quick stop, uh, uh, pop it. Now, for the next one, spin. Uh, Y'all probably already seen it. Half spin of death. That look. Lag animation, catch your opponent off guard. You have that. You have that one too. Um, you know what I'm saying? Which I mean, his spin can come onto a lot of things. You know, so. But it's mostly his half spin that's really good. Oh yeah. Also, let me put y'all on game right quick. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to do a dribble tutorial, but put y'all on game right quick. So basically, you walking back, right? Well, y'all know that one. But you're walking back, and basically what you are, you walking to the side, right? Your character's body is kind of angled that way. And as soon as he turns around, you do a half spin, I believe, to the on ball hand. Hold on. My fault. Okay, bro. Next, I'm going to talk about the reason I chose the shot ones. Um, Go-to shot, right? So basically how you do it, I had to learn this myself. Um, you hold up on the right stick. And your character does the animation. You can cancel at any time. Now, one thing I found, and one thing I, when I seen the animation, I was like, oh, this is probably going to be glitchy, is you can hold it and do, like, a fake, like, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? And, like, fake them out and just pull it up. Like, you could fake them like you're about to drive, uh, during the cat. You know what I mean? 
Like, it's kind of nice. Jibbo pull up. Paul George, man. Look. Yeah, like, bro. On my soul. First shot I took yesterday. Yesterday is the first time I got my hands on the game. First pull up jumper. First fade I did. First everything I did with this. It was chicken, bro. Paul George is literally the easiest dribble pull up the time. There's no reason to need anyone else. Spin jumper. Um, Y'all should know this from 23 and 22. Spin, turn. This year it's a little bit weirder to time for some reason. Probably because I haven't used it in a minute. Uh, there we go. You know what I'm saying? Like, all you got to do, really, is effectively, you know what I'm saying? Little step back, behind the back, drive, cross. My fault. Hold on. Drive in, you crossing. You doing your little dribble moves. Hold on. My fault, yeah. Me locking. All right. So, you driving in, you know what I'm saying? They're going to think you're doing the baseline drive. And then, you know, because everyone's not. Okay, now nah, I'm not going to say everyone. But in 23, baseline warriors were really exposed. It was in 20 and 22 as well. But baseline was really prominent in uh, 23. And basically, if you feel like you're about to go baseline, spin, you're most likely going to catch your opponent off guard. <laughs> I promise you. Half them niggas are brain dead bots. Hop jumper. Um, this explained itself. Paul George. It, like, he. Come on now, y'all. It's 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 Paul George, bro. <laughs> Glock in, bro. Um, post fade. Uh, actually, I actually haven't tried this one out yet in a minute. Well, as you can see. As you can see. Okay, maybe I'm not. Okay, maybe that was well. Nope, yep, it's that animation right there. It's 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 one ball hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, it's it's off ball fades. It's off ball fades is what's nice, I think. That's what I was just doing. It's that animation right there. Um I believe it's it's off ball fades for the the pro shot creators wanna know it. You know what I'm saying? Post hook. I'm not a post hooker, bro. Don't, like, Giannis is just one of the good ones. Don't ask me about that shit. Post hop shot. Um, it's Harrison Barnes. He's always had the best animations in that regard. They're not the best, but he's always had one of the best animations in that regard for a long time. You know what I'm saying? And then uh, layup. I mean... Lamelo's is good, bro. I mean, you, you really don't need anybody else. So, I don't know why you would. His hop step animation is good. Fake. It's all right. You know what I'm saying? His hop step is really good. His jelly. Damn it, didn't let me do it out there. Um, I don't have a clip, sadly, but I know you can. Trust me, though. Um, there you go. Oh, my God. I guess you just have to wait a little bit, then do it. That's my fault. And then y'all been obviously seeing the damn dunks, but if you want me to tell my dunk, you know what I'm saying? Um, ah. You know what I'm saying? Like, Clay Thompson. Um, If you want to see the Malik Monk or the... Dunk package that Steve was talking about. If I'm wrong about Malik Monk, then I'll put it above my head. You know what I'm saying? When I edit the video. But uh the dunk package that uh Steezo was talking about, that's all you need, and all you need is an 80 driving dunk and an 80 um I mean in a 70 uh vert. I'm pretty sure it was Malik Monk. Like I said, if it was wrong, I'll put it on the screen. But you know what I'm saying? That's all you need. And if you don't want that, I mean, you still got uh, Clay Thompson, you know what I'm saying? Because this build isn't really about dunking this year. Y'all know I love dunking, but I just did the move I've been trying to do for, like, to put y'all on game. You see this part of the animation where he fakes like he's about to, you know what I'm saying, pull it up, and then he goes for the pull up. That part right there is what you want to look for. As soon as his hand moves, you see right there, his hand's about to move towards the ball. Ugh. You know what I'm saying? You can fake that drive. See that little speed boost I got? That's what you want. So, you know what I'm saying? You're comboing, comboing, comboing. 
doing your moves, uh, little step back, uh, uh, little half spin, you know what I'm saying? And you about to go back to baseline, fake, uh, you could drive in, fake, uh, like, you know what I mean? It's a little, it's a little quick fake. You get a little speed boost out of it. I don't know. Am I, am I clicking chat? Like, you see that speed boost. Like, you know I'm not bullying. You know I'm not bullying. That speed boost is kind of crazy. I don't even think you have to let the whole animation play out. It's just like, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Um, I'm a master it, though. We're going to see what's up. I'm going to test some other dribbles, too, and uh, probably update my SIGs by the time y'all get that dribble tutorial. Um, it might be in December, chat. I know that's long. I know that's mad long. But by December, we'll probably have the next battle pass. And it'll give me a chance to have some more dribbles to work with and um, actually, like, master the stuff. Maybe I'll do it uh, next week. I don't know. Well, uh, my build isn't upgraded, and you know what I'm saying? We don't really got the funds right now to, you know, upgrade our build. So we're going to be testing all of it here. So actually, yeah, I think I might, you know what I'm saying, do it tomorrow or next week. But, you know what I'm saying? Thank y'all for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe. Um, whenever the build video drops, check that out, please. Thank you. And, uh, the jump shot video, y'all must check that out. Like, actually, this jumper right here, it's my best one. And then I have another one. You know what I'm saying? And then I have one final one that I'm not sure if it's really, like, that good or not. But I think it is. Now, one thing that I will say, all of these jumpers are great. And all of them, you only need an 85 three-point to get. So they're perfect for people who are running, like, mid three-pointers this year, like me. So make sure to check that out when that comes out. And I'll see y'all in the next one, man. Peace. Like and subscribe, man. Let me know if y'all want to see that dribble tutorial. Oh, walk back. Oh. Oh. Oh my, oh my god, no, 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 that's my clip, that's my clip.